strategically right decision taken this morning to start our Gotland Sleden north side first as we have a tailwind today going 25 kilometers per hour good speed and there's one church I think the third one today I guess we're gonna see quite a few of them during this journey this is church number five Hello there! Gotland sheep, the original ones, and there are quite a lot of here. Every second for you, I'm chasing, I'm climbing, I'm searching, I'm falling, it's worth every second for you. I'm chasing, I'm climbing, I'm searching, I'm falling. Taking ferry from the main Gotland island to Faro and that's where we need to find our camping it's approximately 15 kilometers left to ride we have done more than 90 already so quite a, quite a distance today cold I think it's seven eight degrees plus maybe and quite windy we did 117 kilometers today way more than we thought we we're gonna do we thought maybe we're gonna do 70 80 kilometers but uh, ended up 117 so we deserve a good dinner and we will have some uh, nice cheddar cheese local uh, mackerel smoked mackerel from uh, the Gotland then we have a uh, garlic butter and some freshly baked bread from Gotland as well. And as a backup, we have a West Coast chips. That is just for a backup. And of course, we have some tea because it's cold. lovely morning on island Foro it's a small island in the northern side of the Gotland separated by strait and you can take a ferry to get here and it's for free so that's very good and uh, well not much going on here at the northern part of the Faro island it's just forest and uh, I read a bit about the Faro island it's around 500 people living here permanently and actually Ingmar Bergman Swedish famous filmmaker was living here and passed away here as well I haven't seen any of his movies but maybe I will get some inspiration after his biking tour to watch one of them here at old fisherman's village this looks very nice very well preserved as well look at these boats I guess they're not in use today but back in the days where when fishing industry was booming in Sweden they were used a lot
65 kilometers already I've been bike today we just had very very nice pizza and actually pretty cheap one as well just 100 Swedish kroner for pizza good beer as well So we biked today 95 kilometers and we did a tour on the Faro Island and now we are on the campsite enjoying our dinner and then we continue again tomorrow. Full sun today again around plus 10 degrees celsius and today we're gonna do we have two options actually to do either 80 kilometers or we do 110 120 kilometers let's see how we feel had excellent lunch in a fish smokehouse here in Gotland highly recommended the fish is amazing and now we continue our journey south we have done already uh, almost 40 kilometers it's going very well so far let's see if we manage to do 120 today Another church, I think it must be like a 28 at least that I've seen. Bibliotheque or library, check it up. Oh wow, look at this, all these books over here. Small working station. So we have done 100 kilometers today and look at that big cow over there it's massive hundred twenty four kilometers today what a day cheers for that with some nice merlot red wine Good morning, day four on 
biking tour around the Gotland and today it's a bit windy a bit chilly morning I would say and we are planning to bike today probably 100 plus kilometers let's see how it goes all these holes are rabbit holes and honestly I haven't seen in my life so many small rabbits running around the roads so it, the population here in Gotland is massive of rabbits been a tough day so far with a lot of headwind and cold wind we have done almost 80 kilometers and I think it's at least 35 left a bit tired today so I think it's because of a four day already cycling so uh, hopefully soon we reach our camping and then we can rest a bit used to be a bunker here but now they have built a really nice chair around it very innovative by by Gotland and we are having our Gotland's tonic it's pretty not that bad it's really good actually and you are having the Fladerlesk Fladerlesk good soda after biking 95 kilometers We have been on Gotland four days and this is the first time we see a beautiful sunset. And to summarize today, we did 118 kilometers. It was a fun ride through different landscape. It was quite a challenging in the middle part because of headwind and a bit cold as well. And now we're enjoying a lovely dinner here with some nice local beer. Day five, cycling around Gotland. This is our last day as well, as we need to actually catch the ferry today to go back to the mainland Sweden from Visby. It's a short day today, I think 50, 60 kilometers maybe. We have cycled the most of the Gotland Sleden already, so and today as well is the best weather by far. We are wearing like a short sleeves, shorts, because it's like 19, 18 degrees maybe plus Celsius. We just officially did 500 kilometers on Gotland's Leden. Fanciest church on Gotland. I must say, Wisby is a very beautiful town, a lot of history here. So we're gonna just stroll around with our bikes here, explore the city, then find some place for to grab a couple of pints of cold beer, some light lunch, and then we're gonna just chill in the park and wait for our ferry boat back to the mainland Sweden. We still have like four hours left.
chilling in Whitby. Loads of stuff going on here. We had some great lunch, pancakes with salmon, very good ice cream. And now we're just waiting for our ferry boat to take us back to the mainland Sweden. And to summarize, in total, five days cycling around Gotland, we did 507 kilometers. I think this is the longest bike ride we did. We did five, 450 kilometers before in four days. It was a lot of fun, highly recommended.